Dr. Zakir, what are the reasons behind Muslims continually falling into these same errors, Ramadan after Ramadan? Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam, ala rasulillah, wa ala ali wa sahabi ajmain. The main reason that Muslims keep on committing the same errors in the month of Ramadan regarding the rules and regulations of fasting is lack of knowledge of the deen, of the religion of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the major reason for this lack of knowledge is because most of the Muslims, they do not read the word of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. They do not read the Quran with understanding. Neither do they read the hadith, the authentic sayings of the last and final messenger Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. What we Muslims should do is read the Quran with understanding, read the sayings of the Prophet and the seer of the Prophet. Then inshallah, at least we will have the basic knowledge of our deen, including the rules and regulations of fasting. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he always opens up his pathway. He gives guidance to the Muslims, but there is a criteria to whom does he guide. Allah says in the Quran, in Surah An-Kabut, chapter number 29, verse number 69, that those who strive in the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, those who do jihad fi sabilillah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala opens his pathways for them. So the criteria for us to get the guidance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the criteria for us where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will open up our pathways is to strive in his way, to do jihad fi sabilillah. And Allah says in the Quran, in Surah Nahal, chapter number 16, verse number 43, as well as Surah Ambiya, chapter number 21, verse number 7, Allah says, Fas'alu ahal zikri in kuntum la ta'lamun. Which means, if you do not possess, or if you doubt, then ask the person who possesses the knowledge. If you doubt anything, ask the person who's knowledgeable. And alhamdulillah, we have in our ummah, several Muslims who are scholars in this thing. So it's our duty to ask these scholars, these people, who have the knowledge of Islam regarding the rules and regulations of our deen. As far as fasting is concerned, which is one of the important pillars of Islam, every Muslim should know at least when is the time for fasting, what are the basic rules and regulations. And today, in this age of science and technology, it's very easy to find. It is only the negligence of a Muslim that makes him unaware of these things. It's very easy today to know when is the time for fasting, when does fast begin, when is the time for suhar, when is the time for iftar, for breaking the fast, what are the things that break the fast, etc., etc. It is mainly due to the negligence and ignorance of the Muslims that we regularly keep on falling and committing the same mistakes.